Ricochet, Hero in Training and Combat Training. Lots of training today, huh? We have a War Monks, and that's it. We don't have anything else. We only have two items, but we have a bunch of economy. We could go for Ricochet, but I have to check if Nomzi is a beautiful cannoneer. She is not in this game, so I'm gonna not go for Ricochet. I'm gonna reroll this, guys. So let's get something good. Clear Mind, Lagoon Crest. Laguni Crest. We'll take a Clear Mind, guys. Let's take that Clear Mind. Let's play as much good stuff as we can. Level up. Play her. Play a Filios. Sacrifice nobody. It's all good. And then do we have anything else? We have an Executioner's Edge. Sell, sell, sell. A oh, boom. Warmogs. Warmogs is going to be a good sacrificial thing as well. But for now, it's on our two stars. So we're not going to pop him away. Clear mind for the people who don't know. If you have no champions on your bench at the end of a round, gain three experience points. So we're just going to go fast nine. We're going to play a beautiful dragon board. And we'll, go, we'll have a jolly good time, okay? A jolly good time, guys. Not too bad. Did I miss something exciting? Yes, Voki. You missed the worst RNG I have ever had. But it was still cool. Still gonna be a video. But it was by far the worst RNG I have ever had. And I hope this game is gonna be less of a slot machine. Nah, I'm not hoping for that. It's good that it's a slot machine because that's the way it's fun. Uh, Aphelios. Aphelios. Aphelios, just level up. Play another Aphelios. Just level up. No cap. Oh boy, I did an oopsie, but it's fine, it's fine. We just play another Aphelios. We level up. Uh, Lagoon Cavalier. Boom, boom, boom. Worth. Why is it worth? We sold our two star, but now we have three Warmogs. That's 3000 health, guys. That's a little bit more than a two star. Warmox is a very, very good item to um, Dark Flight in the early game. It just adds so, so much health to everybody. Just too much, you know. And the Dark Flight gets 600 health as well. So these, these homies are getting 1.6k health. That's just a little bit too much for the early game for anybody to handle that. So, yeah, even though our board looks poopy weak. Looks very weak. I have two Aphelios, a Zeri, an Ezreal... And the Rel, all one star, it's still very strong. Okay, so now what? No two star Aphelios, a beautiful. We even get the perfect unit to feed into them. Alright, sick guys, good start. Really good start, guys. Let's get it. Played one game yesterday. I got five Swains at level six. And then Pandora's Bench. That is very cool, so he can... That is very cool, man. I'm a little bit jealous. What's up, die dogs? What's up, man? I wish I was that lucky in this fair game. Yeah, true, true, true. Are you blackmailing more dog? I don't think he is. You just sometimes get lucky, sometimes get unlucky. I'm sure Sohikin is getting uh, chased by demons, by sleep paralysis demons every night. Because, um, you know, you got to balance out the RNG, man. Then you get unlucky in real life. It is what it is. Luckily for me, um, you know, whenever I get attacked by a demon during night, it's not a sleep paralysis demon. It's an actual demon, guys. It's what it is. I just beat them up, man. Because, you know, I've been training a little bit more lately. Eating pretty healthy. So, um, you know, I'm pretty strong. I learned to control my, um, my uh, fire element. So I can shoot some fireballs now. It's pretty, it's pretty sick. So we just beat up the demons. And luckily for Sohikin. He's watching the stream. So um, I actually, you know, visit his home. Because, you know, I like to, I like to visit my girlfriend. His mother. Um, but yeah, I like to, I like to visit my, my woman here. And then um, I step by in his house, uh, in his room when he's sleeping, and I just beat up the demons for him as well. So, guys, what's the moral of this story? If you want no demons, you should subscribe, because then I will beat them up for you. No worries. Also, a nice bonus is your mom is going to be very happy, and then you will get chicken tendies every single day for lunch. And you'll be a very happy boy. Anyway, guys, that was really cringe, but let's focus again on this game. 
What do we do here? We don't level, right? Do we pre-level? I think it could be worth to pre-level. We get 5 XP per round, which is not enough. I think it's worth to pre-level. No cap. I think it's worth to pre-level. Yeah, we could get better stuff, man. I think it's worth. I know usually you shouldn't press the button at all with this clear mind, but I think it's worth. I think leveling fast to a high level, man, and just getting a bunch of good purple units and stuff is just too good. You know what's weird? I'm living alone, so I don't know what a GF you have at my house. Maybe the neighbor ghost. Oh my god, man. Don't talk about ghosts. Oh my god, man. He's... How did you figure out my favorite hentai? W what? Huh? I didn't say anything, guys. That was crazy, bro. Do we play a Lagoon Dragon? No. No shot, right? Is there anything we can play? I guess we'll play this. Omega Lul. Who gets the attack damage, by the way, man? I guess she she's replaceable. I kind of want to keep the Aphelios, man. I'm liking the Dark Flight so far. It's serving me well. Warmox is a great item to Dark Flight. And it's going to be great for the next couple turns as well. Like, it's going to be great all the way through stage 3. And then st after stage 3, like stage 4, you know, people go 7, roll down. They get some 2-star dragons and stuff. Then it gets a little bit rough. But we get a nice little win streak. It's not too bad. First time on the stream. Love the YouTube videos. What's up, Icy Lemonade? Glad you enjoy the content, sir. I'm thinking here, what should we put instead of the Wookie? Wookie. Instead of Wookie, boy. I guess nothing, just chill, bro. Just chill, doesn't really matter. We all know the only thing you dream about is 12 Shimmer Scale. True. A Wokage? True, man. Anyway, guys. Um... You know what? I never read her skill. Let's do it. Rel forms a tether between herself and her lowest percent health ally, dealing 150 damage to all enemies between herself and her bound ally. She also grants herself and her bound ally 35% of Rel's current armor and magic resistance. That's a great unit, guys. I never read her ability because I was like, eh, why? Why would I read her ability? We have an Infinity Edge for Rengar. I think it's just a Dark Flight game here, guys. I'm super down to just level. And roll it down to zero. Try to find Darflight Rengar or something. Stop! Guys, I messed up! Now we don't get clear mind because I'm not selling this guy. We can't sell him. It's too good. We cannot sell the big man. Oh, it's okay, guys. It's okay. Don't worry about it. We just missed 3 XP, man. I'm very sad. I'm, I'm heartbroken. I am heartbroken, guys. I am heartbroken. What is the best insult for Swain anyway? Tank or AP? Tank. Because his AP doesn't scale his uh, healing up. Just health. So health is actually really good. Kill your heart. Big friend. Big friend. Less damage. Big friend. Start next to a big friend. Oh, wow, that's really good though. That's really, really good, no? That's really, really good, isn't it? Alright, so let me just sell. Let me sell. Oh. Let me put this. Alright. So, what do we need? We need a Rengar, right? Alright, so basically... More than how much health? More than 1.6k. Alright, nice. So everyone gets damage reduction now. I'll just keep the Warmox the entire game then. Let's do that. Everyone gets damage reduction. That's really good. 
Your units that start combat next to a unit with over 1.65k health take 10% less damage for the rest of combat. I'm pretty sure it procs. So we already tried, literally today, we tried Dark Flight with Exiles. And first the Dark Flight pops, and then the Exiles pops. So I'm pretty sure this best friend, uh, big friend, will also pop after that. So it means, um, yeah, everyone's gonna proc it on their friends. So we just need to pair them together. We just need best friends positioning. Super good, guys. Super duper good. Absolutely amazing. Six Dark Light. Uh, Soraka. Mr. 100 with Dark Light. <laughs> really, bro? You're gonna make me that lucky now? After the previous game, you stupid game. I am. So I'm pretty sure she's gonna take. Is there an animation to Big Friend? Let's zoom. Let's zoom in and look. Yeah, look, she's li lit up. Oh no, that's Starcaller. Oh, okay. I thought she's litty, bro. Are you not litty, bro? Mister One Hundred with with uh, this thing. It's too good, I think. Uh, just roll for 2-star Rengar, stabilize, keep this Mr. 100 for as long as possible. Because now she's gonna start one-shotting enemies. <laughs> Super good, guys. Did Aphelios change his weapons? Mm, no clue. Clueless. Clueless, man. I am as clueless as I could be. Level 8, we just play another assassin. And that's our team. Uh, so we want Rengar items or Swain items. I'm gonna go for a Swain item, I think. So it just delays the fight. Nice, we got magic resistance. Not bad. Uh, we could go for... Dragon Claw, maybe. Okay, so... Do you think they're getting damage reduction? Like, how do I check? So, I'm pretty sure this should apply just like a... Just like, um... Exiles. And Exiles applies after, so they should. I could also just put her here. It doesn't really matter, just to make sure. Just to make sure. Yesterday he shot his purple weapon and stunned. Now some big ball, so I don't know. Oh, I'm clueless. Oh, this is the best friend. Look, this is the big friend. He's lit up now. Oh, so he didn't... Okay, okay, so it is lit up. It is lit up. Yes, he's lit up. Okay, so the reason why the Aphelios wasn't lit up with big friend... Is because obviously she doesn't have enough health for him to get damage reduction. So this positioning is fine. This positioning is fine. Yeah. Okay, so I'm pretty sure... Do I just level here? To keep the win streak? I feel like it's fine. It's perfectly fine to just level. We get another assassin, you know? I think it's perfectly fine, man. I think we got ourselves a tuber. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, he's lit up. He's lit up. So it does work. Because he was just touching her. And she doesn't have enough health without the warmogs. So it works. It works. Very good. Very good, guys. Oh, yeah. Warmog's crazy with this. Nice, man. I like this. And again, the... Soraka is one-shotting enemies. 3.5k true damage on Soraka. She will always one-shot two people on the enemy team. Because she can't heal me anymore. I'm already max HP, so... That is the thing. Beautiful. We don't buy this. Not too bad. What do you think is the best way to use Darfly? There's a lot of different ways. It always depends on your game. Are you playing Cannoneers? Then probably... Uh, you know... Uh, are you playing Assassin Carry? Maybe an Infinity Edge? It, it always depends, man. I like uh, items that fit everyone, though, like this. 
It's pretty good. Oh yeah, we, we, we don't get 3 XP. It's fine. We still have a 1, co one star rel. Oh, we got the thing. And yeah, we could go for a Morello again. Yeah, I like the I like the Morello a lot on him. I actually like it a lot. We did that today already. Okay, so now we just roll down and we just try to hit some two stars. We hit one. We try to hit more two stars. We hit another one. There we go. Okay, nice. We play her. Okay, and now now we just collect some econ. Now we just chill here. We drop the calm mind for now or the clear clear mind. We just drop it for now. We need two star. Um, or we just stay level 8 for now. What do you think? We could just stay level 8 now. Because all we need is... Um, like... Yeah, 3 star Rengar might be worth. What do you think? Do you think we need 3 star Rengar? Also, we'll get another augment here. Might be Dark Flight Heart. Or a Dark Flight um, Emblem. What else would be a good augment? A again, big friend. Assassin Crown. Holy moly. Assassin Crown is really good. We can go for Assassins. Let's do that. Let's go for Assassins. More damage. That's really good. Hodge is not the best item, but it's fine. Yeah, there's the Diana. We could go for Assassins immediately. We can easily go assassin uh, this guy. This guy can be our assassin. Yeah, I'm sure he's the assassin. We can go as four assassins immediately, but the Soraka is better for now. For now, the Soraka is better. Until we lose one round and we're not Mr. 100 anymore. I think I'll give it to him. I think it's fine on him, bro. And then we go 3 star, yeah, we stay at this level and we go 3 star Rengar. We don't even go 9, we don't need to go 9, guys. We just go 3 star Rengar, 2 star um, Nila. Great game, man. And the Soraka is better than 4 Assassins right now. 4 Assassins is actually really good in this set. Look, 40% crit chance and 25% crit damage. It's gonna do a lot. Big. Uh, just keep donkey rolling, no cap. Like, get that, uh, or I guess I shouldn't. Especially since I 2-starred him now. Yeah, let's let's collect some economy now. 2-star rel would be fine. Oh, I have to think about the best fr uh, the big friends positioning. Think about that. Don't forget that. Get it on Aphelios as well. Put them in the middle, so they touch the... The Sijuani. The Sijuani gives them big friend as well. She has enough health. Not bad, bro. How much damage is Aphelios doing? I'm sure he's doing fine. Warmox is really good to Dark Flight. And Swain is so good now. Could have gone Assassin Swain. Would be kind of fun, but not worth. Again, his healing doesn't scale with, am with the amount of damage he does. Uh, bow on bow on this girl is perfect if we get it crit is also good all right we get a crit it's fine a bow on nila would have been good since it's a nila with a bow i get two star and we're good this could be my first mr 100 game let's see on this new set, I mean. Uh, we can just put this crit on... How much health does she have? Yeah, yeah, she has enough health. So we just do this. There we go. And then we do um, this on Nila. I assume she's going to be our second best tank. Uh, second best assassin. We could also go on the Aphelios, to be honest. <laughs> it would be fun to make the Aphelios do a lot of damage with the assassin and thing. He's doing a very decent amount, bro. 
Well, let's just keep it for now. Because it might not be an Infinity Edge anyway. It should go on Nila if it's an Infinity Edge for sure. She's gonna do so much with 4 Assassin. Uh, this guy is very strong, but I feel like my amount of health that I have on this team is just too much. Nice, bro. Really cozy game, man. Holy moly. We might not even have to play for Assassins because we just have Soraka do it being Mr. 100. <laughs> we might just have Soraka Mr. 100, man. Assassin Graves, maybe? Nah, we won't have room. If we want to stay level 8, we won't have room. We can only kick Soraka and put this. We, ha we have to keep the 6 Dark Flight. It's too valuable. And the Aphelios is actually really good. Aphelios is super good, bro. Because he gets the Warmogs, man. Okay. Yeah, Soraka deleting the enemies. <laughs> it's a little bit too much for them as well. He's going Dark Flight as well. Oh, but he has Soul Siphon. So they're all getting Tempest. That's cool. They all get damage increase. That's very, very cool. He's dangerous. He has a good Rengar as well. Soul Siphon on Kiana. Very cool. Not bad. Everyone basically benefits from the Tempest thing. Uh, so they just get 20% increased damage. Or actually 10, I think. Because he only has 2. Yeah, he only has 2. So they get 10% increased damage. He only has 2 Tempest. Yeah, yeah, you can see the big friend. They're all lit up. I thought it's her star color trait, but it's actually that. 10% decreased damage. Demon Slayer, Infinity Edge, extremely good, can't complain. Extremely good. Well, that means we go for a very big uh, Nila now, because she gets Infinity Edge and a Demon Slayer. That is absolutely amazing. I could have gone Demon Slayer on him, to be honest. Mm, I kind of want to level now, because, nah, we should roll for Rengar. I feel like I won't lose this Mr. 100, that's the thing, so I will never get 4 Assassins. <laughs> this Demon Slayer should be insane, man. And she has the water. She's the water thing as well, she's Tanjiro. Oh my god, she's Tanjiro, bro. No way. She has the water breathing technique. Oh no, I'm, I'm gonna bet chest. No, guys, I'm gonna bet. Oh, chill, guys, chill, 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 chill. Chill, guys, calm down. Uh, three star Rengar incoming as well. I wish I could give him. I mean, I could give him the Demon Slayer. I think if we get three star Rengar, we give him the Demon Slayer. I think we do it anyway. We do it right now. Yeah, go three star Rengar, Demon Slayer, Rengar, GG, bro. Oh, he's actually going for the Dark Essence. Maybe they buffed it. Clueless. He has the Soul Siphon with the Tempest, but seems like I'm still out sustaining him. Yeah, my dragon is too big. Heals much more, even though he has uh, this thing, which is very cool. But, oh, but this was the ghost, so we could still lose. Isn't Assassin Graves better than Nila, or am I dumb? You're a little bit stupid, because I literally just told you that we can't fit it. If we want to stay level 8 and go for 3 star Rengar. Don't you see how we can't fit it? We, we already have only 3 assassins right now. We're keeping her right now because she's better because she just kills two people. And then if I want to stay level 8 and I'm staying level 8 to hit 3 star Rengar because I think it's going to be better than going level 9. And, you know, and then Eli is good. I don't know. So if you're going to ask like that, then yes, you're a little bit stupid. Just a little bit. Um, why you don't have custom subscribe badges and custom point shop? Because I'm a scuffed streamer. I'm a scuffed streamer, my guy. I don't have these fancy things. Yeah, look, see? The Demon Slayer girl dies too quickly, but this guy has Warmogs. So it's better to go Demon Slayer on Rengar. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. But she's still the highest damage unit. Oh. Rengar 3 happening soon. Again, we don't have that much value from going level 9. Like, what would we put? We would keep the Soraka and put her. Yeah, we would get 4 Assassin. But if... 
if we can keep the Soraka, we're Mr. 100, right? We have no worries anyway. Like, as long as I'm Mr. 100, I'm Mr. 100. I'm chilling anyway. And I want to go 3-star Rengar, because that's cooler to see with a Demon Slayer. Right, guys? Right, guys. Ooh, Demon Slayer Soom. I see she dies too quickly, bro. I'm telling you. This thing is not dead yet. Oh, it's dead now. Nice, we win. That was kind of close, bro. Wait, what is this? What does this do? A Spear of Shojin and a Zeri. Very good. Lagoon Crown is very nice, bro. Very, very nice. Okay, do we, do we slowly but surely roll it down? Or what? We need two more Rengars. Uh, Infinity Edge. Infinity Edge. Is what I would like to have. Death Blade. Is what I would like to have. Oh, we might hit 3 star Nila. Now it's a different bread. We might hit 3 star Nila. How come no Demon Slayer on Sacrifice would be funny? It doesn't work. Can't do these special items. Otherwise, we would for sure. Assassin Yasu would be pretty good. Ooh, Nila. Oh boy, it's a Nila. Okay, maybe three star Nila incoming. Who knows? I'll try to get it, guys. Will be fun. This Rel doesn't like me, apparently. And the Soraka is too good, guys. She always keeps deleting two people. She's too good, unfortunately. I want to kick her. I want to go for Assassin, but it's too good. Uh, Mr. 100. First game, Mr. 100. Finally. Yeah, exactly what Woki said. It changes into this Darflight thing. Es essence. <gasps> okay, we have to decide. I think this guy is very unrealistic. I'm gonna decide for Nila here. <gasps> Alright, there we go. We go one. That is just great. And then we just try to get the Nila as well. <sighs> Not, right now it would be better to have Demon Slayer on him, but... And the Death Blade as well. But this is fine. This is actually fine because she can have three items. He can only have two items because I want War Monks on him. It's too good to pass up on. But again, I don't think we have to worry about this game at all. We're too strong. Oh, right, now it's a 1v1. He has two lives left. We need to just pray that we get a Nila. Okay, Bloodthirster on Jin is fine. Actually, we'll pull off. We'll pull away this. Do this right here. And do this. There we go. Then we go Bloodthirster on the on the guy with Bormox. Seems pretty sick. On this Rengar. Now the Rengar is very happy too, yeah. I think that's the best of both worlds. We're getting a bunch of Dianas. Which I don't really want. So he has one more life, basically. He can survive one more time. Should I ditch her and try to 1v1 him properly? Nah, I want Mr. 100, guys. He has one more life. He just hit a 2-star. I hope he doesn't surrender. Oh, he has Nila as well. Okay, that, that's almost impossible to hit then. Yeah. We, we have to find the three last Nilas. It's gonna be very rough to find, guys. Unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Very, very unfortunate. I would have loved to find... ...the three lost Nilas, bro. Or uh, to find three-star Nila here. But I don't think we can. 
I'm pretty sure at this point, I think four assassin will be stronger. He almost beat me. Do we just level? I think we level. Yeah, I want to keep my Mr. 100. I'm a little silly boy. I'm insecure, guys. I'm insecure. He surrendered. It is what it is, guys. Ah, man. First Mr. 100 of the set. We'll take it, guys. Very well played. Warmogs on Dark Flight. Extremely good, guys. Subscribe, ring notification bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in a YouTube algorithm so I can get some more views. And I'll see you next time. Peace.